Well, good afternoon, everybody. It's another great day for Pasco County as we make another big announcement for our county in the Tampa Bay area. We're ecstatic to announce that American Idol is coming back to the airways in 2018 to its new home on ABC. And we have even bigger news for Pasco County and the Tampa Bay residents that Florida Hospital Center Ice in Pasco County will host this year's Tampa Bay Idol. This is a local competition as a, this is going to be a local competition uh, and give residents the chance to earn a ticket to be on the front line for the tryouts in Orlando in August. The top winners from the Tampa Bay Idol competition here in Paso County will actually receive a ticket that guarantees them the chance at audition in front of the line for American Idol producers during their bus stop in Orlando, Florida. We're excited to see how many Pasco County and Tampa Bay residents shine during this competition here at Florida Hospital Center Ice in Wesley Chapel. I also want to take a minute to thank Commissioner Stark and her great team for working with ABC and Florida Hospital Center Ice to bring this competition here to Pasco County. And with that, I'd like to introduce Gordy Zimmerman, which is the president of Florida Hospital Center Ice. Thank you, Commissioner Mike. Uh, I just want to say thank you. Um, to Pasco County and Commissioner Starkey and Commissioner Moore and their their whole team over uh, you know throughout the, uh, the county administration and to help and bring this event I want to thank ABC for coming out and the rest of the media and uh, I guess from our point of view that the facility here is uh, more than an ice rink and uh, we do have five ice rinks in the building uh, we have a lot of events that happen on a continuous basis whether it's uh, you know a corporate event or a uh, a birthday party or you know we're doing a hockey tournament or a learn to skate or a you know uh, just a recreational league both youth and adult and uh, so we're very excited to host we want to welcome uh, American Idol to the facility and uh, we're really looking forward to the date and I'm going to pass it on to Commissioner Starkey for the final words. Thank you and this has been a very fun project to work on. So the next American Idol musical superstar could end up being right from right here in the Tampa Bay area. And this Tampa Bay Idol is a great way for us to showcase some of the tal talents that our residents have. Audition sign-ups begin on August 5th at abcactionnews.com slash idol. The first 400 reg registrants will have, a, will have a chance to audition in front of a panel of local celebrity judges on Saturday, August 12th, here at the Florida Ice, Florida Hospital Center Ice. Make sure that you register to participate online before the auditions on the 12th. Those spots are expected to fill up fast. And having Tampa Bay Idol as a stepping stone for the American Idol audition is a great experience, and we encourage all our talented residents to register and audition. You can find out more also at PascoCountyFL.net, and good luck to all of you. We look forward to seeing you here at Florida Hospital Center Ice. Thank you. Can we just talk about what's the importance of uh, coming to the Pasco tryouts? You're going to get a special benefit if you are selected, right? There will be some what they call golden passes that will allow um, these lucky contestants to go to the front of the line and be admitted right into the American Idol auditions that will be held in Orlando. So it's kind of a special bypass for those lucky folks who secure those. Commissioner Moore, do you want to talk about the local talent around Pasco County? You must be proud of the fact that we're going to showcase that here in Pasco County. Well, well thank you. Yeah, yes, Doug, obviously we're excited about our local talent being able to uh, showcase them, themselves here at Florida Hospital Center Ice. There's a lot of great talent in Pasco County in the Tampa Bay area. So I know we're going to have some, uh, we may even just have that next superstar that could come from Pasco County. Could be the next uh, Carrie Underwood. <laughs> you never yes. know, right? I know. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Any other questions? Kathy, Eight, Tony. Is there age, uh, yeah, 18 to 28. No, not. I'm sorry. Let's look here. I think, I think it's, it's 14. Well, give us one second here. We do have that. 15 to 28. So the age, yeah, it's ages are 15 to 28. So unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to try out. <laughs> I just missed it by a year. <laughs> Well, um, this used to be on another channel, and it's switching this year over to the ABC network. And I received a call last week from ABC News to see if, uh, if Pasco County was 
interested in um, participating in, in the program. They had seen um, this facility and thought it would be absolutely perfect for, an, for hosting an event like this. And so um, we said absolutely we would love to host Tampa Bay Idol. And uh, they came up toward the facility and, um, and we signed our contract today and we're off and running. Yes, she's standing right back there. <laughs> I'm not sure all the layout, the layouts, but I think there's going to be more than one room um, with tryouts because um, there th we expect hundreds of hundreds of folks to try out, so there'll be multiple rooms uh, occurring. We'll uh, expect up to a thousand people over the course of the day. You know, that will be auditioning, and uh, we have the seating area that's like an overflow that they will be waiting their turn and uh, there's other parts of the building that they uh, you know can be entertained while they're waiting or practice or you know so we have uh, you know a snack bar on site and uh, you know they can uh, obviously get a meal here if they're their wish but uh, we're, we're just real excited to have the event I think uh, you know being uh, something new we're six months old uh, we came online just here in January 21st, and we've, uh, you know, made an economic impact to the county with other tournaments and competitions that we've already held. Uh, we've had some national events, and so this is just a contributing uh, event that uh, we're excited, and Pasco County's support uh, has been tremendous throughout the, the course of the, the construction phase and operations here, so we're very pleased. And, uh, we're expecting um, a large impact in all our uh, venues, you know, all our restaurants and all our shops around the area. I've already notified the shops at Wiregrass, who actually is one of the sponsors helping us with this, and the uh, out Tampa Premium Outlet Malls to expect, expect a lot of business that day to staff up and, um, and get ready because we're going to have talented people from all over the Tampa Bay area coming right here to this spot.